bags of heroin along with cocaine found in Bellows Falls last week. The man that police say was caught with it went before a judge t today. NBC 5's Helena Batapaglia was in court. She joins us now with the details. Helena. That's right. According to court documents, the 34-year-old Rockingham man has a history of selling heroin in the Bellows Falls area. Police telling me tonight an anonymous source tipped them off this time. It's an ongoing and continuous issue for the village of Bellis Falls. We have a serious drug problem here. 208 bags of heroin along with cocaine found by Bellis Falls police Friday night as part of an ongoing investigation. It's here. We know it and we'll do everything we can to get it off our streets. 34-year-old Matthew Dunn appeared in court on Monday, pleading not guilty to heroin trafficking and cocaine possession charges. Police arrested Dunn in the Hetty Green parking lot after they say they found the heroin and cocaine in his vehicle. Court documents reveal that the night before the bust, an anonymous source told police Dunn's plan to get the drugs from a supplier in Brattleboro and bring them to Bellows Falls. Chief Ronald Lake says the department oh, encourages tips we like this tip from the public. Anybody can call the police department at any time. Anybody can give us information. All we want is the information. We don't need your name. Judge Catherine Hayes set bail at $5,000. Police say once arrested, Dunn admitted to selling heroin locally in the past. Lake says the department is determined to continue cracking down on these drug-related cases. It's just our job to, to take it off the street. And police say Dunn admitted that he regularly picks up heroin from a supplier in Brattleboro. He said the most he's ever obtained is double the amount that police just found. Live in the Upper Valley Newsroom tonight, Helena Batapaglia, NBC 5 News.